Hello friends, Mr. Welsh here. We are going to go through how to submit our work for the Scholastic News. I know people had a lot of trouble last week in terms of logging in, getting into it, so hopefully between the video and between going into this a different way, it's going to help people. So let's give it a shot. We've got our document here, we've got the link where we need to go, and we've got our password. So what I want you to do is to highlight the password. We're going to write, we're going to try to do it right this time. We're going to highlight, we're going to right click on it, and we're going to copy it. When you click on this link, it's going to bring you here. You're going to go up to login. Login, thank you. Going to select I am a student on the classword classroom password line we're going to right click we're going to hit paste our password goes right in we're going to click sign in and it's going to bring us to this week's issue right here so then to get into the issue we want to explore the current issue Then we are going to open presentation view, open English view, and it brings us into the Scholastic News Reader for this issue. So this has got all sorts of things. You can zoom to make it bigger. These arrows will get you to the next pages. If you click on the read aloud button, it will even read it to you. And make sure you look in these articles because like right here it says click here there's a video that you can watch go to this article there's a video here you can watch there's some charts to look at go into these articles there's no videos in these two there's a video here so make sure you look at those those are some really good information so once we're done with this we're going to go back to our story and we're going to see Scholastic News questions. We're going to click on it. We're going to open Microsoft Word. Eventually, there it is. We're going to enable editing, and here are our questions. You'll see these big, bold headlines here. That is That goes along with what article the questions pertain to and what pages they're on. So, like we've done with our other multiple choice questions, say the answer to number one is uh, students were inspired to reduce food waste. So we're going to take all of our other questions, all of our other choices, excuse me, and we're going to delete them. Now I know the letter changes, but I just need the answer. I can match the letters, that's fine. So then when we're done, we're going to highlight everything. Oh, went a little far. We're going to right click. We are going to copy. Then we're going to go onto our student page, and there's a to-do for Scholastic News. Copy and paste your answers here, brings us to that nice document. We're going to right-click, we're going to paste, and there are our questions and answers for this Scholastic News article. We're going to hand it in, and that's how we're going to do Scholastic News this week.